Hey everyone, Microsoft, Apple, Amazon, Nvidia, and Alphabet all have surpassed the $1 trillion market capitalization milestone. A awesome feat to be sure. But there's one stock that I think will join them in the $1 trillion market cap area very soon. What is that stock? I think it's going to be Meta Platforms. Right now, Meta Platforms has a market cap of $762 billion after having these volatile times in recent years. It surpassed that $1 trillion mark already at one point in 2021, and then the valuation collapsed all the way below $300 billion, and now it's rebounded back up to 762 billion dollars i've had meta platform stock rated as a buy all throughout 2023 in fact it's been one of my top stocks to buy throughout 2023 so now i think it could reach the one trillion dollar market cap club in i would say a relatively short amount of time could be this year more likely next year or the following year after that but in the if you're looking at longer term the probability of that happening increases meaningfully. And partly because what I have here is uh, Meta Platform's revenue over the trailing 12 months. You can see in the last five years, Meta has increased its revenue nicely from 50 billion all the way up to 120 billion. After 2022, you could see some difficulties Meta Platform's faced, namely from three sources. Number one, Apple made it more difficult for meta platforms to collect information on its users and therefore sell targeted advertising. That was a headwind. Secondly, TikTok was rising rapidly and taking consumer engagement away from social media companies like meta platforms. And third and finally, market participants reduced advertising spending or slowed it down because of macroeconomic uncertainty surrounding inflation and the war in Ukraine. Meta platforms has found a couple of good solutions to counter a couple of its headwinds, including its own short form video format that's been very successful at taking engagement back from consumers who were looking for short form videos. Now they have an option at Meta Platforms to watch short form video. They don't have to go to TikTok to watch those types of content. So Another area that Meta Platforms is making progress in is its operating profit margin. You can see it collapsing after 2021. The company made an announcement saying it's going to spend more than $10 billion per year developing the metaverse and that caused its operating profit margin to fall considerably. Lately, however, Meta Platforms has, I don't want to say reversed course, but it has paid more at attention and placed more importance on profitability by announcing mass layoffs, by announcing a slowdown in hiring, by announcing several other cost cuts, telling investors, look, we know you care about our profit margin and now we're going to care about it too. We're not just going to send billions of dollars out with these long shot investments that may not prove fruitful until the year 2030. So for those reasons, investors have gotten more enthusiastic about Meta Platform stock. And lastly, even after Meta Platform stock has increased in value uh, for this year, and let me go back to the market cap, you can see it's more than doubled from less than 300 billion to over 762 billion. The valuation is not too expensive. It's trading at a forward price to earnings of 18, roughly average, roughly the average valuation of stocks in the S&P 500. So it's not like the stock is trading expensively. So there's more room for that multiple to expand over the next 18 to 36 months. The company can certainly expand this multiple if it's successful in those initiatives I mentioned earlier. So for all those reasons, I think Meta Platforms could be one of the next stocks to join the others in the $1 trillion market cap club. I want to thank The Motley Fool for sponsoring this video. Visit fool.com slash parkev for the 10 best stocks to buy now.